Hello everyone. So today let's talk about the Hamilton Khaki Field Watch. This is an oversized Hamilton Field Watch. Let's roll the intro. Hey, so hello everyone. Welcome back to another watch video. Thank you so much for tuning in. So today I'd like to share with you uh, a watch that I've owned for several years now. This is a Hamilton Khaki uh, PVD edition. It is a large, it's a, it is a larger fill watch than normal. Uh, it is a 44 millimeter watch. Um, the numbers, the, the numbers, the model numbers, I will include into the in the description. And uh, if there's anything that I leave out in the video, it will be in the description. So take a look at that, please. Um, let me think here. So this is, like I said, it's a 44 millimeter uh, wide watch, not including the crown. The crown is actually a pretty good size crown. Um, easy to wind, and it it is signed. It does have a, an H uh, for Hamilton. Roughly 12 millimeter thick, beautiful dome crystal. It is a sapphire crystal, scratch resistant crystal that's are in uh, in a lot of these uh, new watches nowadays. Um, 22 millimeter band, uh, and uh, it, it does come with the rubberized band, and we'll chat about that here. I'm gonna swap that out for you guys. And the ETA 2824-2 movement, as you can see, it is functioning there. All right, uh, I think I believe it has a roughly about 42 hour reserve. I could be wrong. Um, smooth bezel, uh, water resistant up to um, 100 meters, 330 feet. Um, let me see what else. Um, the it is a rubberized band. A lot of folks do have mixed emotion um, about this band. A lot of folks don't like it because it is a beautiful rubber rubberized band. However. Folks do not like the um, the uh, alligator pattern. I think it's pretty cool. I think Hamilton makes some of the best bands out there, or at least they put a lot of great bands on their watches. Um, it does have a H uh, buckled uh, for Hamilton. Again, beautifully signed band, rubberized band. So um, with that, um, it is a push-pull crown. I think it's hacking. See, as you can pull to a second-hand stop with a, a day window at uh, a, a date window at uh, three o'clock. Sweeping hands, of course. All right. So what I'm going to do? Oh, here. Let's talk about the numbers. The numbers are applied, and uh, it does have a decent loom in it. The picture didn't do it any justice, but the loom is pretty decent. It is white. The number one through twelve are applied numbers and um, as you can see the the five second indice the mark in there is and there is a um, it is applied however the second markers are painted and the 24 hour uh, uh, the 24 hour time markers there are painted on and of course Hamilton is there in the middle and khaki etc is on the uh, painted on the on, on the on the face the face is black this watch gets so much attention when I wear it it does have great wrist present it doesn't look that bad um, on your wrist um, let me compare it to uh, my daily wear uh, my daily wear is a um, Hamilton uh, jazz master uh, 18 karat gold it is a limited edition to uh, uh, to 200 ever made um, the number is marked here on the side of the watch. I put it on a uh, a blue leather band. Uh, 
All right, so let's do a comparison. This is a 44 millimeter and this is a 40 millimeter. It doesn't look that bad, but I'm gonna swap out the band and I'm gonna put it on the wrist. Uh, my wrist is, I don't have a huge wrist. It is a six, uh, six and three quarter wrist and uh, it, it does look pretty decent. Uh, like I said, you know, the, um, uh, I, like I said, I, I do get a lot of, a lot of looks uh, when I wear this particular watch here. Um, let me see. I was gonna say something about this. Um, yeah, but so I'm gonna, uh, what I'm gonna do is, uh, I bought a new band uh, for it, uh, and uh, I'm just gonna try it out and push it aside. I'm gonna try it out. So here it is. I did make a couple of mistakes uh, when I bought this, uh, when I bought this band. Um, bought it on Amazon, I think I paid 15 bucks for it. It is a silicone band. Um, I bought it in, it is a black, uh, uh, with the, the back of it being orange, uh, to match the, uh, the hands on the watch. Uh, I don't know if you can see the, the where the mistake was, but this is a, uh, this is a chrome buckled and, uh, I should have paid attention to it a little more and, uh, and get a, uh, a black, a black buck, a buckle because it's all, you know, it's all blacked out. Um, but anyways, it does have a quick release and comes with a pretty decent tool, um, sharp looking tool, um, sharp point, and uh, I think this is to pry the old um, the old pins out uh, because this has a quick release. Um, so with that, I am going to. I put this video on hold and uh, swap out the band uh, just because this is an extremely sharp object and I will I will put some holes in my either cut myself or put some holes in my hand so uh, so I don't need that on camera I'll be back okay guys so uh, uh, I swapped it out um, what do you think not too bad right it's pretty good looking. I do. I mean, I don't know. I, I like. I kind of like the uh, the Hamilton band um, better. I just guess I I would just used to it. Uh, but anyways, uh, not too bad. A uh, couple of little holes as uh, as anticipated. Uh, just kidding. Um, but anyways, let's let's put it on the wrist. Uh, my wrist here and see uh, see what it looks like. Oh man, that's smooth. That is a smooth band. Uh, like I said, it's, uh, it has great wrist present. Uh, let me move it over here and see. Uh, it does have great wrist present. Uh, the, the bad thing about not having a uh, um, an anti-glare on this uh, on this sapphire crystal, as you can see, you know, when you see my ceiling fan, you can my cameras actually it's my phone but uh, anyways actually I think it's really cool I just have to get a, uh, a black buckle um, I'm gonna keep this on for a couple of days um, to see uh, how I like it and uh, and if I don't I'll uh, I'll replace it but uh, check out the back oh my goodness that is a smooth band that's a great band huh I'll be darn. All right, so check it out. It pretty, it pops, right? All right, guys. Um, let me see here. So let me share the band with you. If it, if the band would have sucked, I wouldn't have gave you the um, I wouldn't give you the uh, the name of it. But uh, it's a generic band uh, from uh, from whatever this is. I don't want to screw that up if I say it wrong. But uh, anyways. Um, here are uh, the barcode. If you like it, it's on Amazon. I think it's $14. Um, with that, that is neat. Uh, with that, uh, you guys have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for, uh, for coming in.